Hello everybody, thank you so much for watching. My name is Alexander, I'm a Porsche certified sales professional at Porsche West Palm Beach and thank you so much for watching my YouTube videos. If you appreciate my YouTube walkaround videos, please consider subscribing to my channel. Please hit that like button and feel free to comment down below. You can also contact me directly via cell phone or email with my contact information being in the video description. In today's walkaround video, we'd like to present you this spectacular 2022 Porsche 911 Carrera S Cabriolet. This vehicle just arrived at our dealership. It's part of our certified pre-owned inventory. So in today's walk-around video, we'd like to highlight the build specifications of the specific car. And of course, talk about the 2022 Porsche 911 in general. With this being the 2022 model, this is the latest generation of the Porsche 911. The model code for this specific generation is the 992. And the 992 is now the eighth generation of the iconic Porsche 911 sports car since it was introduced in 1963. Introduced here in the US market, the 992 is a model year 2020, and again, this specific car is a 2022. On the outside, um, with the specialty paint, shark blue, a new color that we introduced not too long ago. A very cool story behind the shark blue exterior color. Feel free to Google it and you'll see a cool story how Mr. Andreas Poirier came up with his new color for the latest generation Porsche 911. Next to the shark blue specialty paint on the outside, this specific car also equipped with the sport design package on the exterior. Recognizable by the redesigned front fascia of this vehicle with more aggressive styling. Let's take a look at it. In my opinion, very similar to the turbo models of the 992. With this again, aggressive styling on the intake system on both the left and right hand side. Also the front splitters you can see painted in shark blue as part of this sport design front fascia. And then this specific car is also equipped with the optional adaptive cruise control and the optional surround view camera system. Another factory option on this specific uh, 911 is the LED matrix design headlights. Recognizable by this specific inner housing design, we have the standard LED headlights, and again, this is the LED matrix. And also to indicate that technology, Porsche puts a beautiful script on the inside of the housing. The 992 Carrera models are now the widest body 911s ever produced by Porsche. On the previous generation, the 991, we had a narrow body and a wide body, depending on the all-wheel drive or four-wheel drive. Uh, sorry, the two-wheel drive version. Uh, that difference is no longer, so regardless if this would be a Carrera 4S Cabriolet or 2S Cabriolet, the body width is now the same. Very wide front fenders also for the 992. Look how wide these, uh, these are. Also love the positioning of the headlights within the front fender. Uh, Porsche was heavily inspired by the 930 Turbo from back in the day, and definitely some design lines can be found in the latest generation 911 uh, with the inspiration of that classic Porsche. The wheels are the beautiful modern version of the Fuchs design wheels. Again, a retro design on the modern day 911. Love this five spoke design. Finish on the inside, as you can see, in high gloss black, and then right behind it, the red caliper indicating the S trim level. This one also has the sport design side skirts on the lower section. So, sport design package plus sport design side skirts. Getting here to the back of the vehicle 21 inches in the back, 20 inches in the front, which is now the New wheel setup for the 992, at least for the S models. On the Carrera models, we have a standard 19 inch in the front and 20 inch in the back, but on the S's, you automatically upgrade to the 20 inches in the front and the 21 inches in the back. With this being a two wheel drive version, you can see that the slats here on the back of the engine deck in the middle are finished in black. If this would be a 4S, those little slats would be finished in silver. Very large rear spoiler for the 992, 25% larger as the previous generation. And again, in combination with the wider body now of the 992, a beautiful design, especially with the cabriolet, the wheels that this specific car has. Now also now we can see the sport design package on the rear. So the rear sport fascia with the aggressive shark fin blades here on the side of the vehicle, on the lower section of the rear bumper. Also that diffuser design in the middle. And that also relocates the license plate area to a more middle section where the standard rear fascia has the license plate on the lower section of the bumper. When you do the sport design package, automatically you do also the sport exhaust system. Finished in this case with the exhaust tips in high gloss black. We also do a silver version. And again, look how white these are. Uh, the tail lights also are incorporated within that rear fascia design, looking spectacular. Also the model designation and Porsche letters, in this case finished in high gloss black as a factory option. Those are some Porsche exclusive manufacturer options that this car also has. So yeah, sport uh, design package, shark blue, the modern version of the classic Fuchs design wheels, looking fantastic on this specific car. Now the mileage on this specific vehicle is only 900 miles, so less than 1000 miles on this specific car. And again, being offered as certified pre-owned. Let's have a look on the inside. 
where this one is finished with the slate gray chalk full leather interior. As you can see the chalk leather has been applied on the seats, on the lower section of the dashboard, and then the upper section of the dashboard and steering wheel finished in slate gray. We're gonna see that same dual tone here on the door panel, so slate gray on the upper section of the door panel and then the chalk colored leather on the middle and lower section of the door panel. And that chalk stitching is also incorporated, as you can see, within the slate gray areas of the door panel and also the dashboard. Another factory option in this car is the optional carbon fiber inlay. You can see it here applied in the door panel that continues here on the dashboard all the way from the left to the right hand side, real carbon fiber, and is also applied by Porsche around the cup holder area in the middle. Another Porsche exclusive manufacturer option on this specific vehicle is the Porsche crest embossed in the center armrest. The seats themselves are the optional 18-way sport seats plus, recognizable by the extra bolster design here for both the seat surface as the backrest. And then you can see all the adjustability that can be done there, including the lumbar support. Also more carbon fiber in the form of the LED illuminated side sills. Multifunctional GT Sport steering wheel is a factory option. The Sport Design package is a factory option. Again, I mentioned the seat ventilated and heated. What a beautiful specification. Again, 900 miles. The engine, a twin turbo flat six, producing 443 horsepower connected to the eight speed dual clutch PDK transmission, powering the rear wheels. Of course, conditions overall is excellent, being such a very young pre owned vehicle. What a stunning design, the shark blue color against the chalk seats. Black convertible top, as you can see. Let's do a final walk around. Again, my name is Alexander, Porsche sales professional at Porsche West Palm Beach, located in South Florida. My cell phone number and email is in the video description. I wanna thank you for watching this video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Be safe out there and see you next time. Bye-bye.